Hi, my name is Suzanne Rowe. I'm a scientist here at AgriSearch and I've had the privilege over the eight years or so of leading a team of scientists as, as we strive to breed a low methane emitting sheep or a low methane emitting ruminant. Uh, we are a group of geneticists, of physiologists, of, of microbiologists and, and ruminant nutritionists and engineers and we've worked together primarily to come up with a solution that helps New Zealand's breeders and farmers meet their environmental targets. Half of our greenhouse gas emissions actually come from agriculture and 80% of that is enteric methane. So that's methane that comes from grazing animals. For us, methane is a very, very potent greenhouse gas. It's, it has 25 times more warming potential than, than carbon dioxide. So it's really, really important that we come up with a system that lowers that methane on farm and that we can hit targets within our agricultural system. The team set out around 12 years ago to measure methane emissions across the national flock. So we took 1,000 sheep from across New Zealand and we measured them in respiration chambers. We wanted to know how much methane they were emitting and what we really wanted to know was whether we could find sheep that naturally emitted less methane than others. And we took the extremes, we took the highs and the lows and we created two research flocks. So we had a high, a high methane emitting flock and a low methane emitting flock. And we have bred them successfully for three generations. So over the last 10 years we've selected for high methane and low methane. And what we have shown very clearly is that methane is under genetic control, that we are able to breed for it, so to select parents that pass on low methane traits to the next generation. And we have a low methane sheep that is healthy, is productive and can be used on farm in the New Zealand system. So the impact of us joining together as scientists to show that we can breed low methane sheep means that we can pass this on to the farm so, so we can have cumulative permanent changes in our methane emissions profile across the whole of the national flock. We can be lowering it using a, a normal and natural system that, that farmers are already using. So we've provided them with a tool at the farm gate. And that's not only for farmers in New Zealand. We've been talking with scientists across the world, scientists who are working with farmers in other countries, and we've exported our technology. We've sent them at the way that we measure things. We've taught them how to measure their own methane emissions, and we're enabling them to lower methane emissions in their flocks and herds across the world.